morning and today is the day we're going to make the worm for the frame so I've got my overhead camera so, yeah, so it might take me a couple of goes just to get the size right but I've got my new tools that I'm looking forward to using and as you know the worm has blue hair slash spiky things so I've got this this is like an old key ring from the pound shop I also made a dead cat out of this you know a microphone muffler so I don't know if I use that or I've got a couple of other options so we'll just see so let's make the worm we'll just add as well that I'm actually going to make the worm out of Sculpey and then I've got some bacon bond there so yeah, so Sculpey, got my tools, got everything I need, so let's get going. So I'm now back in the shed because I was going to put the worm in a little frame like this and I made it a bit deeper but my worm is now too big which is always the case with me. I always make things too big but instead I'm going to put them back in the original idea of a big frame because then I could show more brickwork as well. So I'm going to paint him, uh, put his little hair in and then we'll work on this frame but I need to make it deeper otherwise he is not going to fit and that will be a problem shall we say so just a quick update this is the worm all painted I think it looks more like a zombie worm so it's had a little varnish but now I'm going to do the background for him so it's the next day and all this has dried nice. Hmm, just about the problem. That needs to be on the other side. A fart. No worries, we can sort it out anyway. So what I'm gonna do with this is I'm gonna use some clay and I'm gonna put a really thin layer on here so I can make I wanted I wanted something that didn't make it look like polystyrene and something that I could manipulate into the grooves and give it a bit of texture so I'm going to put a really really thin layer of clay over the top of this because the worm, because the worm is going to sit in there in the wall like it does on the labyrinth so there we are so before I start um, yeah before I start I'm going to put the PVA on there 
extend the clay because that just helps bond it a bit better and if you see me using water it's just to help manipulate it so yeah if you have any questions please just ask and I'm more than happy to help you today's viewing is Jeepers Creepers so let's get going So this is the clay so far, I've covered it and then I textured it with just a bit of like screwed up tin foil. Just dabbed it on just to make it look a bit more real. Had to make sure the worms still fit in the little gap I've made because I am really tight for room because if you can see, I've got a bit of fluff stuck to it. That's as deep as I can go. So let's get that dried and then painted. This is a quick glimpse of what it's sort of going to look like. Not too shabby, I'm just waiting for the clay to dry properly. No right. light on isn't it eh? Yeah so I'll wait for that clay to dry properly then we'll paint it up. But yeah, that's not too bad actually. Not too bad at all. Okay, so update on the wall. I've painted it. So I'm going to let all this dry overnight and then have some stuff that'll set and look like water so the bricks look wet. So yeah, pretty pleased with that. So I'll see you tomorrow. Hi guys. So, well, fast forward a day. We're now on a another day today this worm will be finished 
the wall has dried but some crack a couple of cracks have just appeared in it so i'm going to fix those and then we'll put everything together and see how it turns out okay oh do you like my t-shirt bit of bob ross hail bob ross you are god okay so let's get going so the wall is finished i've given it a quick varnish get it in the light can you see it better really really impressed with the way that's turned out so now it's just a case of attaching the worm framing it all and just hoping like hell that it fits in the frame and I haven't made it too thick I have I did keep measuring it against it but last night I replaced all this wood so it's a full block rather than just like little pieces so I just wish me luck but yeah so far so good very 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 impressed so far so here is the worm the only thing is now she's got the glass now he's got the glass on I always wouldn't say she but it's actually a little boy now he's got his glass on the front yeah I can't really Now he's got his glass on the front, you can't really get a too good a picture because it's reflecting so much. See the outside. How's that? Is that any better? So that was the worm. We finally got it done. Hoorah. And yeah, so thanks for sticking with me watching this and all i can say is if you haven't already please subscribe oh we should be doing a giveaway maybe in the next couple of days i'm not too sure but it is very very soon because we've got something for it so yeah so if you haven't already please subscribe and like look after yourself take care and yeah we'll see you in the next vlog so see you later bye